Welcome, welcome to Thus We Mine. This is Blackout Triple O here. Today I'm doing an inspiration series, if you will, where I am showing, uh, showing you guys some ideas that I had for, uh, I guess, building houses and like the dec the decor inside of them. So I'd like to get into that and show you some ideas. I don't have too many. It's gonna be a quick video, just an introduction. Here I have right here. It's just you know a little uh, mat where you wipe your feet on. Just, you know, as you're walking through, just you know, small things. Here I have a door frame right here that I did, which is just out of trap doors, nothing fancy. But here is something I'm really proud of. Light switch. This took some time, a little bit of time too. It's really simple redstone. But um, obviously I think the cool part is, you know, the glowstone right there. And I'll show you how to do that at the end of this video. Here, obviously just a table, nothing fancy really, just, you know, plates and drinks. Here, like the... Uh, light switch I just put wool instead up here you see cabinets I mean they're obviously not the best but I mean it's Minecraft there's not really any real cabinets unless you use chests which is pretty cool um as you see there's no light in here that it's this light switch there's little there's no torches at all in here so I mean bats spawn but when you turn on this it what happens is there's what the lights can go through carpet which is real nice so you can hide a light really, really nicely. And nobody really knows. Here's just, you know, I have a range in a, fur in a furnace. Over here, it's a little countertop, but it's a floating countertop. So if you look, that's it's uh, pretty much snow blocks all the way up to the, I want to say, oh, seven eighths of a block. I think that's correct in saying that. But um, here's a sink. Obviously, not as good as a cauldron, but still, you know, just something new. So. If walk out of the house real quick I mean I've worked on the village I'm just you know making some new stuff here is a uh, daylight sensor actually sorry it's a nighttime sensor so you can do this and it turns off the light real quick just to you know see if the redstone's still working but at night it turns on which you know it's clearly daytime but it hasn't turned off yet but um at night it lights up in the day it shuts off so it's a nice way. It's just a really a negated uh, daylight sense. That's what it is. It's nothing fancy. No, yeah, no plugins or anything like that. Um, try to get to that later. Here is something over here. Uh, just a neat uh, roof design. I saw uh, some people using it. I just thought I'd, you know, just copy it. I guess. Um, what I've done is I've sort of combined all three of these, which has made it a bit weird. But uh, turned the butcher into like I don't know horse farm really it's a bit odd um but i'd like to get to my uh probably one of the coolest things that i've done it's not huge or any anything spectacular but it's just it's the little things what i did i you know it just looks like a normal butcher i put some pigs in the back no big deal but i made a furnace that actually works so it's a fireplace that guys are still out. Um, but it's a fireplace that actually has fire and you can cook stuff inside. So that's real nice. Occasionally it burns down the house. But it's just a nice little feature that, you know, on a server that would be pretty cool. I mean, downside is, you know, people steal your food. But it's pretty cool. Um, built some other stuff. But it's not worth mentioning. It's, it's kind of small. It's obviously, you know, extended church. Um, but yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching. It's nothing fancy. I just wanted to show you guys some of the ideas I had. Um, here I'll show you the redstone real quick. Nothing big, just you know, negating. it's just well, it's double negated. It's a bit odd, but um, yeah, that's that's. Okay, guys, turns out I actually completely forgot that I was gonna show you how to do that uh, light switch idea. So what you do is you grab the block you want. So let's just take this, and then you get some redstone. Oops, sorry. You grab a, s a lever, not a switch, a lever. Then you grab uh, some, uh, you get an item frame and whatever block you want to put inside. So in this case, we'll use the uh, glowstone, like, uh, like, yeah, like I used in the house. So first thing you do is, you know, there's your wall, let's say, and then you put that. You put your, first you put your item frame there, and then you put the uh, item you want to show on the lever first. And what you do is you get up right close to it, and you, uh, you right click the block not the item frame but the block right here 
and it goes on top of it. And uh, yeah, that it goes on like that. So if you wanted to hook it up to a uh, uh, you know, light like I did in the house. You just do this, and it you know works like a light switch. I mean, it's it's all it takes. Be real cool, you know. Turn off the lights before you go outside. <laughs> you know, just pretty cool stuff like that. And uh, I've not mo I've not noticed really any uh not a lot of people take advantage of this. I've seen a couple let's plays, and I mean, it's so simple. It just wouldn't be hard. So um, I'll show you the furnace real quick. It's not too important, and you guys, you probably. You've seen what it looked like. It's probably it's not hard to recreate, but uh, I'll just do that real quick. Just okay. Grab some flint and a furnace. Wrong tab. So okay, you can make the furnace as big as you want. So let's make it big actually. And uh, pretty simple. It uh, occurred to me one day, and I was just like, wait. That's a brilliant idea. I can't believe I never thought of that before. But, uh, yeah. So it's pretty simple. You just build the, uh, place, the, I guess, the oven, I guess, is what it's called. And you just light it up. And you get your furnace. So, uh, only downside to this, I did notice, is, is uh, when you get food, let's say, let's, let's get some raw fish, raw salmon, new snapshot. So let's say, okay, I'm going to put that in there, and let's put some coal, and I just forgot where everything is. No, let's do charcoal. Let's, you know, you cook it a bit, and, uh, you know, you're waiting for it to cook, and, uh, let's, okay, come on, anytime. And it's just like, you know, you've had those moments where, like, you're doing something, and you accidentally just toss it out, and you instantly burn your food. So that could get a little annoying. Especially if you just accidentally press Q, like when it comes in there, you can just press Q and it goes straight to the fire, and it just burns it. So yeah, that's the only downside. But uh, yeah, uh, if you enjoy the video, uh, please leave a like or and a comment. Uh, but uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I've enjoyed making the video, and I uh, hope to make some more. So uh, see you guys in the next video.